Hello everyone, welcome back. Uh, part 25. Do I need to change the wind? No. Oh, okay, that's good. <laughs> Alright, good, let's go then. Um, I noticed that last time, <laughs> but, uh, during the intro, I forgot to trim the intro down <laughs> so that it came in with where I said hello. Um, so instead, at the start of the last part, um, you got a nice little intro of me clearing my throat <laughs> before starting to run around in circles like I usually do. Um, so I'll try to avoid um, forgetting uh, to trim that down from now on. I need to spend my money. Where can I spend it? I wonder, I don't know when's good to go for the fish as well. Probably. We'll get, we'll get this, we'll get the last pearl or we'll go to, you know, we'll go and do this stuff first. But there's a fish right there, look at him. I don't know why I'm getting this. Okay. Um, let's just get to the island. Uh oh. Hey. Huh. All right. Oh, me a ticket does all. So same as before. Just you know, uh, we came. I don't know. It it came to be visible, and then nanda. Um, just kind of you know. Well, nani combined with da the declarative. So nanda. Like what is this? Sakana no to? Maybe I feel like this game prefers the reading to over Shima. But <clears throat> I might be wrong. Nanto you koto da Shima ga. Um so yeah. Uh to you basically means kind of. It sort of defines things. So saying nanto you koto is like what kind of phenomenon Da. Like what? What's going on? What is this? You know, that's that's that's. Well, maybe it could stand in for meaning. You know, what kind of meaning is this? Um, maybe, I don't know. And then Shima, just the island, and then Ga, yeah, Shima Ga, the island, and then no more information. Just kind of saying the island. Um, yeah. Osokata uh, ka. Um, so osoi just means slow or late, I suppose. Uh, so in this case, it's just you know, um, are we late? Are, were we slow, kind of thing? Or are we too late? Um, what is even going on here? Moshiya to motte ita ga kore hodo made to wa. Moshiya. Let's have a look. Ooh, excuse me. Moshiya. Hmm. Perhaps, possibly, by some chance, by some possibility. Moshiya to motte ga. I'm I'm wondering if this might mean something like. I'm wondering if this means something like I. I thought this, you know, I thought perhaps in the sense of I thought this was a possibility. I, I, I understood, I understood that this was a possibility sort of thing. I understood there was, this was possible. I understood this may happen. I understood this was perhaps going to happen. Maybe. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm, I'm guessing a bit there. But then you've got ga meaning but... And then korehodo means like we saw arehodo recently. Korehodo just means this much of an extent. To this extent. And then made is until. So until this much of an extent. And then towa. Towa. Maybe expresses a bit of like disbelief at something. To wa. Korehodo made to wa. 
No, maybe not. Maybe it doesn't. Maybe it's just particles here. Kore hodo made. Maybe like like here we have Toe quoting this as what he thought, and maybe here we have Toe again quoting uh, this bit of what he thought, and then he's using Wa here to contrast this with what he did think. You know, like I thought this could happen, but you know to this extent Wa. I didn't think, you know, so the war contrasts. So maybe that's what's going on here. And then obviously he's not saying uh, the verb. He's not saying on mod that. But I might be wrong about that. I might be wrong about my assumptions for this <laughs> sentence. Mind you, I might, I might always be wrong, to be honest. I, I mean, I'm hoping I'm helping everyone out. But, um, yeah. <laughs> maybe I've been wrong the whole series. But confidently incorrect, maybe. Um... Konoshima ni wa jabu sama to yu mizu no seire ga sunde o laleta no da ga kono yosu de wa mohaya um let's do mohaya okay um blah 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 where are we where are we well basically at the start you've got regarding kind of to at or on i suppose in these lo loads of you know replaces lots of English prepositions basically um so it's kind of regarding at this island perhaps um the water spirit called Jabu summer um sunde ola sunde olaleta so that's just like you know lived basically actually I was talking to a teacher today about this form um, because it's it's passive, but I think she insisted to me that it's not passive, it just is the same shape, it's the same form as passive. Um, it's a bit like saying, for example in English, it's a bit like saying, I am swimming and I like swimming. Swimming in both of those sentences is exactly the same form, but it's not the same meaning in both you know i am swimming that's present continuous i like swimming is i like the act of you know swimming i have to use the word again because that's how you use it in english you know um so it happens to be the same but it's you know it's different use and this is what's going on here but this is the same form as passive but it's not passive it's although i don't know why he's saying it really it's it's very funny because this is the discussion I was having with the teacher. It was about very polite language. But he's not using polite language at us or with us because he doesn't, he doesn't have to. Maybe it's just... It might make... I wonder if it's like polite towards Jabu. But I don't... I don't know, man. Anyway, the point is that this happens to, you know, completely resemble passive. But it's not passive. Although, who knows, maybe in this case it is. I don't even know, man. Um, but yeah, sunde odareta. Maybe that's just how this verb conjugates. I don't know. Anyway, so anyway, on this island, the water spirit called Jabu lived. And you've got a no for sort of explanation, explanatory language. And then danga, just meaning but. Um, I'm just trying to. I'm doing my top button. I can't, I can't get my top button undone. It's really hot. Ugh. Come out. Come on. Sorry, this is great content, isn't it? There we go. Oh my gosh. Okay. And then Konol Yosu Dewa. So I suppose, yeah, given perhaps. Given or with this yosu, yosu is like a basically a a, a a state. Yeah, yeah, that is essentially it. It's just a state. So in you know, um, given this state, and then mohaya translates apparently to already or now. So I don't know what he's getting at there because he's um, the sentence stops. The sentence ends there. So I don't know if he's saying already. Jabu Summer, you know, has been killed, or you know, already Jabu Summer has left, or something, or maybe, 
No, I don't know. I don't know what he means. But anyway, already or now is the translation. Oi! Oh my! So obviously we've been spotted by this bird lad. He's going to come over. He's got good eyes, man. It's dark and rainy. And we're over here. Uh, yeah, buddy. Koko ni itaka sagashita ze. Um, uh, yeah, buddy. Yup, putty. That's kind of funny. Yup, putty. I think I've said before, yup, putty can kind of mean... Like, as you would expect, and also like, on second thought kind of thing. Like, perhaps he suspected we might be here, but he went, no, that can't be right, and then went and looked elsewhere first. And then, now that he's come back, he's gone, oh, as I thought from the start, even though he didn't think that. Yeah, it's weird, man, yup, buddy. It kind of, kind of doubles up as, like, it's a complete fail-safe word, like, um, yeah, as expected, as I always thought you would be here. But then if he always thought that, why wasn't he just here looking for us? You know, it's, it's, it's a weird word, but there you go. Um, koko ni itaka. So, you know, um. Uh, that's just a question, that car thing. Uh, you existed at here. Um, or you, you were here. And then sagashita is just the past tense of sagasu. Meaning to look for, to search. And then zere for fun. Uh, omae jabu to yu seirei o sagashite iru n janai no ka. Um, omae, that's the pronoun omae. Obviously not our name because, you know, that would be in Romaji. Um, uh, 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 um, I suppose it's like, is not it, uh, yeah, are not you, uh, or, yeah, are not, it, or is it not the case that you exist looking for, uh, the spirit called Jabu, or aren't you looking, you're looking for Jabu, aren't you, kind of thing. Zannen nagara Jabu wa koko ni wa inai ze. Um, so zan nen just basically means unfortunately or it's a shame or yeah those sorts of words and zan nen nagara is a very kind of common full phrase that just means basically unfortunately zan nen nagara um, I use this a lot nagara is supposed to mean like nagara yeah basically nagara kind of means like while something is the case or uh, cased, case, or whilst doing something, you do something else, for example, I don't know. Game wo shinagara, I don't know, um, uta or utao or something, you know, like while playing a game, I sing songs, you know, something like that. Um, but yeah, it's you can sort of just use this nagara with zanen as like a phrase to mean, unfortunately. I thought it might be a bit more complicated than that because of the fact that nagara means whilst um but i suppose that works here as well kind of like whilst it's a shame blah 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 you know whilst it's unfortunate blah 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 but i thought the use might be more complicated but it doesn't seem to be just say zanin nagara if you want to say unfortunately and then jabu wa uh yeah so just jabu um wa to contrast this place with you know like other places basically but it's also or to sort of you know exaggerate that he is not here he is not at this island um koko ni wa yeah at uh, at yeah at here inai to you know does not exist and then zer again for fun um shikash hade ni alasareta mono dana alasareta mono dana Hadeni, I'm wondering if that just kind of means like very much the case, very much so, like very or extremely. Hadeni. Like Hade, you, you, well, I'll use the translations in the dictionary here. Showy, loud, I won't use that one. Well, no, I will, why not? Gay, flashy, gaudy? 
but yeah obviously like like gay and i uh, i suppose the kind of old meaning of the word where it was no not even that really just just like the, the other words think of the other words basically showy loud flashy um so so i guess it does kind of mean like this island has been you know like um uh i don't know uh showily showingly loudly like violent hit upon or something is sort of the idea i think Ara... Arasu? Is it Arasu? Arasu. Yeah, yeah, okay, that's transitive. Okay, Arasu is to lay waste, to devastate, to damage. So Arasarita just makes that past and passive. Um, so, but, you know, sort of uh, extremely, basically, I guess we'll translate that. Extremely... Um, you know, devastated. Mono. I need to review Mono. Shikashi had any arasareta mono da na? Mono. I better ask about it, man. I'll just. It's. It's got a few too many. Meanings. <clears throat> um, I don't know if this is just kind of a emotional thing it might just be like an emotional thing but i have to review mono um kore mo majuto no bakemono no shiwaza lashize so kore mo this also majuto no bakemono no so the uh, uh obviously the uh, uh uh what is it well how did i translate this before was it like Great Beast Island or something? Or Hell Beast Island or something? Uh, Hell Beast Island Z Monsters uh, And then Shiwazo is just like a, a deed. I think maybe usually negative. Let me just look that up. But this is the the doing. The doing of the of the monsters from so and so land. I I don't know. I don't know. I think it might be negative usually, but it might not be. Uh, and then Lashi. So just apparently, basically, at the end. And then Zé again for fun. Demo Anshin Shina. So, but, you know, uh, kind of. Um, yeah, relax yourself, kind of thing. Be calm. Calm yourself. Be, yeah, be calm. Don't don't worry, sort of thing. Um, ome ate no jabu wa shima ga oso waleru mae ni aru basho ni nigete iru yo. Okay. Um, ome ate. Is that just like your your goals? You, the, you, jabu of your objectives? Yeah, okay. Yeah, good. Object, purpose, guide, end, view. Yeah, okay. Uh, and he's put an honorific on it for fun as well. I don't know why. But, ome ate no jabu wa, regarding, you know, jabu of your objective, of your mission. Um, shima ga oso wareru mae ni. Um, so, at before the island was attacked, um, aru basho ni. Um, to an existing place. Um, Aru basically kind of when it sort of modifies another when it sorry when it modifies a noun it often just like can be translated as a uh, like the English a uh, a uh, safe place a uh, place. Um, so yeah Aru basho ni so to a place to, an, to a place that exists somewhere it's just it's obviously kind of non-specific um you can do this quite often with like well this happens a lot with aru hi um which just means an existing day which means a day that has happened you know some like one day in the past i did this thing you, you don't need to be specific you can just say aru hi um anyway yeah so to uh, an existing place nigete iru he exists having run to that place and then yo at the end kind of that vibe changer thing 
Doku da tomo. So basically, where do you think? You know, wh where do you think that is? Omae no marata to. I've done it. Omae no marata shima. Or maybe jima. God damn it, why did that have to be so hard? I was, I was trying to be dramatic there. Um, but yeah, uh, the, shima, the Shima, the island you were birthed. The island of your, of you were birthed. I don't know, that's weird to translate. But obviously the island of your birth. Pulolotosa. Um, yeah, Prologue Island, I, 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 I guess. Ah. Demo Purolo Toni Itema Jabuni Ao Kotowa Dekinaize. So, ah, just a noise, uh, but Purolo uh, Toni Itema, it's sort of like even if. Yeah, even if. It's annoying that if is inserted in the English translation because the if isn't in there, but it's uh, that's that's how it translates. Even if you go to. Um, Prologue Island, I guess I'll call it, um, to Jabu, uh, and then this is that kind of negative potential grammar point. Ao koto wa dekinai, you cannot meet him. And then there again for fun. Jabu ga kakureteru dokutsu wa katai seki han de owarete ite. Soto kara wa haire naku natte iru kara na. Um, yeah, seki. Oh, it's probably seki ban, is it? Yeah, seki ban. Okay, okay. Um, oi. Oh, my legs. I need to stretch properly. Um, yeah. So everything uh, before this dolkutsu is modifying dolkutsu. Dolkutsu means cave. So the cave that Jabu is hiding, or the you know the cave that Jabu is hiding in, um, is oh do oh what do oh what oh do is it just oh maybe it's oh oh yeah I think that's right oh is to what the. Just give me the verb, guys. I don't understand this. Why? Why? I don't want kanji. I want verbs. There it is. Okay. So, o is to uh, to cover, to hide, to conceal, to wrap, to disguise. Um, I think, like, for example, when, like, when it's cloudy... For example, the clouds are all, all in the world, maybe. Or maybe vice versa, the clouds are all... No, I think they are all in the world. So they're kind of covering the world. Um, and this is the passive and sort of a present continuous kind of thing with a te form. So they exist... So, uh, hold on. Um, that, <laughs> that cave exists being covered... With um, katai is hard basically, and then sekiban is just a stone like kind of literally plank, but you know a stone. Yeah, like a thick kind of well plank of stone, I guess if that makes any sense. But yeah, so a hard plank of stone, um, it is being covered with a hard plank of stone, and then soto karawa so. Uh, Again, from what I don't know why was here actually. Well, why is contrasting? But soto karawa. So from outside, haire um, naku natteiru. Uh, I suppose it's basically, yeah, you exist or it exists. Um, no, yeah, it exists having become. Um, can't enter sort of thing yeah this is potential form isn't it um, maybe it exists it exists having become not enterable and then karana so kara is just kind of saying 
yeah, maybe that's just referring to the last text box where it said you can't meet him. And that's because all of this information. Ano kaizo kutachi de sae naka ni wa haide nakata mitai dash. Um, so Anno, just referring to the pirates here, those pirates, de sire, de sire, Anno kaizo kutachi de sire. I think this might mean sort of like even being the pirates, even as the pirates. Um. Uh, looks as though they could not enter to inside kind of to inside um, yeah kind of even even the pirates couldn't get in I think is the sort of the translation there and then dash there just although he's only giving us one reason um, uh, he is using this kind of she at the end to imply other reasons. There are other reasons you won't be able to enter, but this is one of them. But the she just says, you know, that there are other reasons that he's not going to list. Um, that's kind of how that works, yeah. Ano kaizo kutachi desae naka ni wa haire nakatta mitai dash. I think that's right, okay. Oh, sorry about that. Um, my mic is very close to my mouse. That was stupid. Um, Sumanai, oh my. Um, so yeah, sorry, oh my. Oh, okay. He's apologising for this, is he? Okay. Ore wa kaizoku tachi nara, o mae no iru tokoro o shitte iru to motte ukkari. Um, so Orewa, just referring to himself as Ore, because uh, you can. Um, yeah, that's that's a pronoun for oneself. Orewa uh, kaizo kutachi nara. Like I suppose nara is like when it comes to the pirates, or in the case of the pirates. Um, no iru tokoro o shite iru to motte. Um, uh, your exist place. Shite iru. They exist knowing. To omotte. Uh, I thought. Yeah, I thought. Quote. They exist knowing. Your existence place. Sort of. You know. Very literally. Um, obviously much more naturally. When it comes to the pirates. I thought in the case of the pirates. They would know where you are. Um, and then. Ukkari meaning sort of. Kind of by accident. Like a mistake. Ukkari konohanashi. This discussion, you know, what what I've said to you. This conversation. Shichimatan daga. Um, shichimau, I guess, is just like shiteshimatta. Just undesirably did. I undesirably did this discussion accidentally to the pirates. And then danga, I don't know. It might be... It might be just kind of softening the end, like you're saying, like, you know, I effed up, but, and it just kind of, you know, maybe allows him just a bit of modesty, or it does mean but, and we've got more information in the next text box. Maybe. Maybe it was but. Aitsura nani o omotta no ka? Oh, sorry. So, Aitsura, that's pretty bad. Don't say this about people. Um, yeah, Aitsura. So, the Ra is a pluralizer, and Aitsu just means those pricks, essentially. Um, Nani o omotta no ka? Uh, nani o omotta? What what did they think? Kind of what did they think? Chibun tachiga puroroto ni te. 
Huh? Uh, Jubuntachiga. They themselves, I guess, uh, went to Prologue Island. Dokutsu no hairikomo to shiangatta. Um, a kind of, yeah, just kind of enter into, well, volitional form with to suru means to try to do something. So that's kind of what we've got here. We've got haidi komo to shimashita would be a much more easy thing to kind of explain. Um, haidi komo to shimashita. But obviously we don't have that. We have haidi komo to shiyangatta. Um, now the stem of the verb plus yagaru means that the speaker is expressing sort of um, uh, disdain for the verb being done. Um, so this post lad, he despises that the pirates tried to enter into the inside of the eye of the cave um he, he hates that they did that so he's saying ya uh, at the end or rather he's using the stem of suru because you know that's well because that happens to be the grammar he's using but the point is you use the stem of the verb and then yagaru and he's obviously using past tense because it's because it is past um yeah I don't, I'm a bit lost of nani o omotta no ka. But there you go. Um, so those dickheads, I suppose, what did they think? Nani o omotta no ka, jibun tachi. They themselves went to, again, what's it called? Prologue Island. And they effing tried to enter into the inside of the cave. That's, that'll do. Demo kekkyoku hairenakte. So demo just but kekyoku means like in the end ultimately. Haide uh, nakute um, just te forms so that the sentence could continue, but haide nai is negative potential, so could not enter. Ima wa regarding now taura to de at taura island, which is I think is windfall. Um, Nani ka something shte iru they are doing. And then yo, just a vibe changer. So they're doing something at Windfall Island now, having not been able to enter ultimately. Jabu ni aitai no nara, taurato no kaizoku no ugoki wo saguru beki dana. So if I don't know what no is, aitai no nara. I don't know what no is in there to be honest. But anyway, I don't think it matters really. If you want to meet two jabu if you want to meet jabu um you should kind of you should search or you should look um at the wind uh, windfall islands pirates movements or their actions you should see what they're doing i guess and then dana just you know shouldn't you am not i correct uh um, so, uh, sore ni shitemo, kind of, what was sore ni shitemo again? It's sort of like, regardless? Nevertheless, at any rate, even so. Yeah, yeah, regardless. Sore ni shitemo, e bukimi na shima da na. Um, uh, 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 this is a kind of a, you know, um, what, what's bukimi? Unpleasant. Gloomy. Um, oh, I'll try to think of the English word now. What's even going on? Bukimi. Oh, there's a word that I just can't think of. Just can't think of it. Maybe if I search for it here. Ominous. That's what I'm thinking of. I thought of that before I searched. Okay, this is like an, an ominous island, isn't it? Soto no umi wa hareteiru no ni. I guess we can start with that actually. Outside's ocean is sunnying. Although, you know, the, the, the ocean outside is sunny, but. Koko dake makuro na kumo ga kakate. 
Uh, so koko dake here only makuro. Uh, I think that's right. Is that makuro or is it makoku? Nope, makuro. So makuro is just like you know, true black. So pitch black, I suppose. Makuro na kumo is like clouds. I might be intonating that wrong. There's also kumo is also spider. So I don't know if it's kumo or kumo or whatever. Yeah, I don't know which is which, but there you go. Um, so pitch black uh, clouds kakate are kind of they exist sort of having been doused. It's not. It's not. It doesn't actually mean that, but it's just like these clouds exist above. Yeah, I guess that's all it is really. Kakate. And then ame ga futte iagaru. Excellent. Um, so ame ga. Huh? I don't know if this is iagaru in the sense of. Yeah, maybe it is. Maybe it's expressing disdain at the fact that rain is falling. You know, that, that it's raining. Amegafute iagare. Maybe. Or it's amegafute. You know, because it's raining, iagaru. I get an unpleasant feeling. I, I, I don't know which man. I'm, I'm leaning more towards the first, but I don't know. So, yeah, Kono Hanashi o Omae ni Tsutaeru yo Meiji Zelaleta Baru Samaga Kono Shima wa Noro Warete iru to Ite o Laleta na. So, so yeah, means like, you know, um, if I talk about that or if I say that or much less literally, you know, talking of that. Yeah, on the topic of that, talking of that. Konohanashi o omae ni tsutaeru yo. Okay. This story to you convey kind of so that, so that I convey this story to you. And then me zelaleta? Me ji zelaleta? No, must be me, right? Must be me. But I'm not getting... Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me look up the kanji. And then zit. No. This word doesn't exist, apparently. Um, Maybe meize? What does meiji do, then? It must have okurigana, right? Meiji do. Yeah, yeah, it does. It has okurigana. So it must be meize lalita. Uh, and that's, I, I don't know, I guess it's just the same as meiji do, meaning, excuse me, to um, order someone to do something. Um, so maybe meizeru is to order as well, but it's just not coming up in my dictionaries. But meizelaleta, that's kind of passive and past. So having been ordered so that I convey to you this story. Hold on. Baru samaga. Hold on. So we have a kono hanashi o omae ni tsutaeru ya meizeraleta baru sama ga. Maybe this isn't passive. Maybe this is what I was talking about earlier where it's kind of a politeness thing. Yeah, maybe this is a politeness thing and it's like... Maybe, yeah, maybe it's Velu Sama who, instead of being being ordered to do it, it was Velu Sama who ordered so that I convey this this story to you. Um, and then we've got Ga here. So this all modifies Velu, maybe. Uh, and then talk, and then kind of talking of Velu. Konoshima wa nora warete iru to itte orareta. Na. Uh, this island, ex you know, 
exists being cursed. It is cursed. That's all we need to say, isn't it? It is cursed. To quote, ite orareta. He said, Velusama said, this island is cursed. All right, cheers, man. Omae mo konna tokoro ni nagai, nagai shinai hougai. Okay. Excuse me. So, omae mo, you also, konna tokoro ni at this kind of place or at such a place. Nagai. This means like exist, to exist, to be somewhere. And this is long. So it's, you know, um, uh, longly exist, to be present longly. Shinai is just negative, right? To not exist longly. Hogai, that's kind of advice, isn't it? Um, uh, I, 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 I don't know, man. Shinai, hogai. I feel like this is kind of, ho is like a choice of two options. So it's like either we be here longly or we don't be here longly. And the direction of not being here longly is is better for us, maybe. Jabu no koto tashkani tsutayetaze. So, uh, Jabu's business. Um, sorry, I was a bit confused there. I was just wondering if I if if in the last text box or whatever we had Valu and not Jabu. But I don't. I think it was Valu before, wasn't it? Now it's Jabu. Okay. So Jabu's business or Jabu's situation, uh, Tashkani, just meaning like, kind of. I suppose kind of, certainly, like, confirmedly, absolutely. Um, and then Stayata, like, you know, I I have told you for sure, I am certain that I have told you, kind of thing. Or just, you know, kind of properly, or, I don't know how to translate it into English, really. Um, I don't know, I guess I have properly done my job of telling you about Jabu, kind of thing. Not in a negative way, I don't think. I think it's just kind of, you know, I am maybe happy to have finished this job properly kind of thing. It's, it's maybe like that sort of vibe, but it's, it's tough to translate. For me. <laughs> um, Alright, cool. I might leave it there then. Yeah, I don't want to talk to this boat, man. He's going to take ages, probably. Um, yeah, cool. Let's leave it there. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, like, you know, like if you want, don't if you don't. Sub if you want, don't if you don't. Thanks to my patrons. Hope it's been worth it, and I'll catch you next time. Bye.